Women's Basketball Tournament kicks off today, and Greenville police have extra security in place. The department says officers will be inside and outside of the well for this entire five-day tournament. They'll also be directing traffic. This is the first time in more than 10 years that tournament has been back in the upstate. And it's also a day for Greenville County students to see the players up close. 7 News is Christine Scarpelli already on the court at the well this morning to tell us everything that's going on. Hi, Christine. Yeah, you guys were having a lot of fun. It really is kind of a great time to preview this because this is a big deal. SE tournament coming to Greenville hasn't been here since 2005. And of course, USC kind of being that home team, that favorite team coming into this in that top spot. And of course, they want this title because it gives them a great position to go into the NCAA tournament coming up. So we're going to talk about the Greenville County students as well. This is kind of the school day where those kids can come in and watch a game, see these players up close and personal, take a look at some video. Now these players coming here to the well. We're learning all about how the court is being put down and what great things this means for Greenville. Lots of people coming in, a boost to the economy, and of course, lots of eyeballs on the city. We have Lisa here from the well this morning talking a little bit about what this means to the area. And of course, bringing in the kids is really, really exciting. Do you guys do a lot of prep to kind of get ready for this tournament to come in? Sure, yeah. Well, we were lucky enough to host Clemson last season, so we had a good dry run. But there is a lot more than just putting down a court. There's a lot of extra phone lines and internet. We have to get offices set up and it's just, it, but it's really exciting. We're happy to do it and happy to welcome 14 teams to Greenville. I love it. Very good. You gave me some really good advice for anybody looking to come. You said something about what you can bring and how to get tickets. You want to break that down for me? Sure. So uh, tickets are available. They start at $12 for today. You can get them at our box office or at Ticketmaster. Yeah, it's a great deal. Great deal. And if you're coming to the game, the SEC does ask that you not bring much of anything. And if you do bring something, it needs to be in a clear bag. And if you go to our website, Bonsacor Arena.com, we have all the information on there about what to bring and what size it can be. So you will not get that backpack in. You That's won't right. get that bag or, or even, you know, purse has to be something that you can be able to search. That's right. Yeah, small clutch if you're bringing a purse. But other than that, if you have it in a clear bag, you can bring it in. Awesome. Very good. Looking forward to some big games today. We're looking at Vanderbilt. Uh, Arkansas going to be playing a little bit later. Florida. We know USC does not play till day three. So they don't play till Friday. They got a double bye. They're probably pretty excited about that time to come <laughs> practice up and get ready for these big games. Guys, hang with us all morning. Coming up, we're going to talk to some principals from those schools. You heard about those kids coming to get to watch a little bit later. We're going to have all that coming up. Back to you guys. Sounds good. Thank you, Christine.